All right, so today I'm going to do a little video here on how to make a fish hook out of a safety pin. Yeah, a safety pin. One of these little guys right here. Uh, so we're going to go through this really quick. This is going to be a short video. Um, I keep safety pins in my bob. They're attached to my bob. I've got them uh, through my little pouch for my Gerber. I've got two of them hooked into that. Uh, I keep them in different places. They're very they're very useful to have them around. First of all, if you split a seam, they're great for fixing that. But uh, we're going to make a fish hook out of this one. Now, this is what you see, a diaper pin, safety pin, whatever you want to call it. They're pretty common. can be found anywhere. This is my uh, multi-tool that I carry with me. I keep this thing on my hip all the time. Uh, the only time you'll see me without this is if I'm wearing a tie and that rarely happens. So uh, pretty much I got this with me all the time and I can do everything I need to do to this, fit, this uh, safety pin to make a fish hook. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to cut it off as close as I can to the spring. Now can you, if you can see there where I've got the spring at, cut this little coil right there just like that. I'm going to take it get as close as I can with the cutters. I'm going to grab both parts of it right here. Alright. Now this part, if you want to use this to make a safety pin, or a fish hook, you can, um, but you have to sharpen one end of it to do that effectively. But we're going to take this part right here and we're going to make a fish hook out of it. You're, gonna you're not going to catch Moby Dick with one of these, but um, I've caught some reasonably sized bass before. Now, <clears throat> I like to use these uh, hooks, and I like to make them so that the, the point, the hook itself, runs in this kind of configuration. It doesn't, I don't know that it makes a difference if you turn it one way or the other. Uh, it might. I haven't noticed a difference in my experience, and that's what I'm going to say. Now, we just give that a little bit of a twist right there. And as you can see, there's a little angle on the end of that. And we're just going to start making little bits of a bend here and work our way down to create our hook. Now, this isn't going to be a perfect. It's not going to be completely circular, but it will be useful. All right. Now, so what I got here is a hook. It's got a little angle back to it right there, in towards the, the shank of the hook, the shaft, and I can take that, put a worm on it or a grasshopper and put my line through here and I can catch fish. I have caught fish with these before. So this is Quaid and, and that's how you make a fish hook out of a safety pin.